morning. Welcome to CCTV. Chris speaking. You guys check out this asteroid. I, I've caught this thing on four of these fireball network cams. This is just a quick report to show you stuff is going on. They say there's a new moon. Uh, the astronomers are calling it a mini moon. And uh, I might have a picture of that. But I have this picture of this asteroid. It's got... It's got atmosphere around it coming in, going by. Um, this is just like four second clips. I slowed them down a little bit, and you'll see the meteorites, uh, some a little bit bigger. There's multiple sizes of asteroids, meteorites. Um, asteroids are absolutely frightening. They are, but there's no fear in Jesus' name. But uh, get up here, I, I found a planet upside up one of these suns, or this is all nighttime, so this is all moon. And this is from February 3rd to February, I must say, the 15th. There's a, something going on there. I'll extend that a little bit, freeze it, and zoom in on it. Just really quick clips of, uh, of meteorites. But I really wanted to show you that asteroid, so this is just a quick video, fireball report. I'm going to do the more extended one. All I got to say is, God, Jesus, this is some pretty frightening times, people. Serious stuff going on in the skies. I hope you enjoyed this little quick fireball report. I'll talk to you later. God bless. Now, those of you who are not familiar with the uh, Fireball Network, it's a NASA-run program. These cameras overlap from state to state, Oklahoma, Tulsa, Arkansas, up to the Blue Ridge Trail, uh, up to the lower areas of Ohio. So you're going to see some of these uh, meteorites and some of these asteroids actually confirm one another. On the bottom left, you'll see the timestamp, and on the bottom right, you'll see the location, the name of the of the uh, actual camera or the cam. Um, so you're going to see more of that asteroid. You'll see more stuff like this. I can't explain. Maybe it's just clouds. Maybe it's just an asteroid. But I found a number of asteroids in the last couple of weeks, so people be ready. Never know what I'm going to pop up with next. <laughs> but uh, these cams overlap, and they're you know they're miles apart, so they confirm one another. It's all synchronized with a satellite, a couple satellites up in the ISS um, working together. They see them from the uh, above, and then it relays it to the cam. The cam actually turns on, I believe, and uh, takes the recording like that right there. That was a cool one right there. Very, very long. Uh, I stretched out the video so you see the meteorite for like that. You see it for seconds. See, it kind of repeats itself. It's a different cam, but confirming the same meteorite. And the real dark ones that are green, they have names for them. I'll, I'll start posting all that. But this is just a quick report. Get you guys ready for the... Uh, the meteorites and the fireballs that are coming in because asteroids are coming in and um, I put a lot of pictures up on Facebook so join us on Facebook now I think this is another shot of the bottom side of that asteroid it looks the same with the lights and I'm going to do some more filtering on these um, you know so, so, so keep up with me on Facebook you'll get a notification no matter what group you're in and uh, I'll let you guys know I'm putting another video up. So just as much if it's notified on YouTube, it's notified better on Facebook. Uh, people do get the notifications on their phone and all. I also have Instagram and all that, but I don't use it heavily. I use um, uh, Twitter. And um, it's Fernald underscore Chris. At Fernald underscore Chris. And that's how they get a hold of me on Twitter. Anyways, I like these fireball reports. And a lot of a lot of these cams, these these types of cams, um, they're total 360 around. You know, you can see the ground all the way around. And they usually only operate at night because that's when you see fireballs. Occasionally, they'll get one in the daytime. But that is actually the moon you're looking at right there, folks. See how bright it is? So they say that one is just totally weird. I'm going to put a little filter on that one. I'll be right back.
smaller they said something ridiculous like six by 11 feet i don't know if you'll ever see that unless it's like up in the clouds right so i don't know it's in our orbit they say and it's been here for three years well if they've known it's been here for three years why didn't they tell anybody and that's what we're seeing in the sky and i think it's the asteroids that i'm reporting that they're trying to you know confuse the issue i'm just speculating guys but um Sometimes these fireballs, check this out, sometimes you'll see them going straight and they'll make a left-hand turn. I've only caught a couple of those, and I didn't really point them out, but sometimes they do. Um, that would be a UFO. I, I would consider that to be a driven craft, you know? But you find, you find uh, planets around these cameras. You find asteroids. You find, like, that's just pitch black, no stars hardly at all. You know, that right there, let me stop that. Kind of looks like a mountain. To me. Uh, I don't know. Maybe a monument of Trump will go on there. Looks like the side of a mountain. Anyways, I just like to point that out. Okay, this is a special narration I added to it. Um, they, I just uploaded the video. They copyrighted me on my own original. Uh, music maker jam free vid uh, free music that I made I made the music they copyrighted me on it so since I pulled it back down I put a couple pictures in pictures to see some planets and some rocks beside the Sun hope you enjoyed that that was thrown in extra because they're messing with my video anyways um, so I've been showing you these flybys you know this stuff's real people keep watching thumbs up So look what I did. I put a search from the 3rd of February to the 15th of February. I got 7,080 7, results for February 13th. Uh, the big thing was Valentine's Day we're going to hit by an asteroid. And that's what they're saying. And if you remember back um, last month, or not last month, a couple weeks ago, I caught that and I did it on Mike and Paul Begley. That was a flyby asteroid, so... You know, it's just a lot of stuff going on. The cams are not showing a lot of big stuff. Like, but that asteroid was big. But, uh, just incredible how many reports. How many articles. 7,080,000. Where's the 7,080,000? That's quite a bit. I'm just showing you a few. Uh, asteroid to pass Earth in February. So, I think we're catching them. This is proof to me we're catching something on these cams. And I'm going to keep looking for more. You guys get pictures of what looks like an asteroid in the middle of the day ripping through with clouds and a drag on trail. Send it to me. Large asteroid will hit fly on Earth on February. Will fly by on Earth. Fly by Earth. What? So I'm going to keep looking for them. Uh, you see any more reports on anything local, new? Uh, February 27th. I'm going to look on that one today and see if I can find something new to show you next report. But I'm going to start doing these reports more often, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Thumbs up. Like the video. Shout it out to at least four or five people. Help me break the shadow banning. Watch this.